Hi, this is Travis Rogers. I'm going to talk to you for a second about how to add contacts from LinkedIn to your CRM tool easily. So first of all, when you log into LinkedIn here, what I like to use Sales Navigator. Sales Navigator is, is about $80 a month. It's well worth it. Um, so I suggest you take a look at what Sales Navigator can do for you. First of all, what I do is I put together a list of the, the uh, contacts or accounts that I'm hoping to target. Um, so let's just take uh, some example here. Um, what I like to do is use the least common denominator for the actual company name. In this case, it says Dentegra Insurance Company. We could probably use Dentegra Insurance, but let's first try with Dentegra Insurance. And whenever you're adding them, you typically don't want to add the co or the ink at the end. Um, so let me show you what that looks like. So when you go into LinkedIn, um, into Sales Navigator, type in the name of the company up here at the top. And what it'll do is it'll get you give you a list of leads. So first of all, it starts with um, it starts with a list of the contacts, which would be the leads. So right now we have 194. What I like to do is I first like to build my account list because once you build your account list, it's a lot easier to dive into. It's sort of the starting point of what you start un uncovering the contacts that you want to get in touch with. So first of all, let's save this account contact or excuse me account into your your um, account uh, list over here. Um, then what I'd suggest you do is you go into the actual account, just kind of confirm that it is in fact the company you're looking for. It helps when you have the URL here as well. Looks like they've got 94 contacts over at Dentegra. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to um, start refining this search a little bit more. So I only want people in the United States. Um, typically I will you know, uh, look at the different roles or functions down here. Um, in this case I'm going to look for marketing because um, we're looking for folks in the marketing department at Dentegra. So it looks like we don't get any results there. So let's widen our search a little bit more. Include sales, different people call marketing, different things, business development, entrepreneurship, etc. And let's see if it brings us to some contacts that are of value for us. So looks like we've got a few good contacts here. Let's uh, add uh, Pamela to our lead list. So again, this will add her right into this list of leads over here. Um, so continue to add those that are relevant. If you want to connect directly with her here, you can you can do so. You can view her profile or you can also view people that are similar to her. Um, so once you've had that, once you've developed that list of leads, um, you can show you how to do that. But in this case, we're going to go and take a look at her profile. And I use a tool um, called Export to CRM. It's actually a free plugin to the Chrome browser. So you have to be using Chrome browser to do this. But basically, um, this uh, export to CRM tool allows you to just by a click of a button view if Pamela is actually in your Salesforce database already. So we use Salesforce. It's got plugins to other tools as well. But in this case, we want to look at um, exporting her directly to Salesforce. So what that does is it actually um, you log into your Salesforce instance. And from there, it will create that person as a lead for you directly inside of your lead function of Salesforce. So if you if she is a first connection, it will actually populate email address and more information. So ideally, what you do is you add them as contacts. And once they accept you, then you can get full contact details on who they are. But in this case, we're doing a call list. So we're going to just add Pamela to that lead list there. So going back to uh, to Salesforce, the other th tool that we like to use is a tool called Outreach.io, and Outreach allows you to then add her right from the sidebar here. It's got a little link, um, and her information is automatically parsed into Outreach.io. Um, there's a lot of other tools, a lot of other CRMs that you can add. Uh, typically, most of them have uh, plugins to to Google Chrome to do that type of thing. So that's it. Quick and easy way to add uh, contacts um, from LinkedIn to your CRMs. Travis Rogers, thanks for your time.